All right, what can you say about the start of this season? Man, we're excited, you know, um, joining Coach Griffin and the staff here at Hart County, man, it's, it's big expectations. He's really grabbed the bull by the horns and has, has built this program into a contender, and we look to contend for a district championship again this year and hopefully a regional championship. So what can you say about your transition? Uh, it's been a smooth transition. You know, me and Coach Griffin, we've coached together in the past, and uh, a good friend of mine, we actually played high school ball together, so I've known Chad for over 30 years now, and uh, we're from both from Elizabethtown area, and um, I was I was excited about a chance to come down and uh, join his staff. It's been a smooth transition. Uh, everybody's welcomed me with open arms, man, and uh, we're just looking forward to the season. What, what do you bring to this team? Well, uh, hopefully I'll just bring a little pop, a little pizzazz. Uh, I like to coach with a little fire. Uh, we got a lot, tons of experience, you know, winning four regional championships, playing for a state championship over at Elizabethtown High School. So I just hope to add some of my insight to some of the kids and and, and about the culture of the game and, and hopefully some defensive insight with Coach Marcus. Uh, he's done a fabulous job. I like what they do here. I just want to – I'm just glad to be a part of it, to be honest. What What was your familiarity with the, with the players that you'll have to work with before you got here? Well, you know, like I said, me and Chad, we've known each other. We call each other. Uh, Friday nights after football games, we call each other during the week, off season. We've always stayed in contact, and so I kind of follow him and follow what his program does. So uh, I'm, I'm very familiar with some of these guys. Also, know some familiar friends with some of the guys. So that's always good to have a common interest when you're coming in and having a little bit of background with the kids you're working with. We have a nice group of kids down here this year, and like I said, they've welcomed me with open arms. And so far, it's been it's been nothing but love. What have you seen out of your guys in, in, in practice? Uh, I'll tell you, the first thing that I was impressed with here at Hart County was the way that these guys, they're approaching the weight room. The first day I came down before practice, you know, the guys hit the weight room, and, I mean, they were bouncing from station to station. They had a sense of urgency in the weight room and uh, pushing a little, some few plates around as well. So, um, you know, we're, we're, we're pretty strong up front, and, and as well as, as backs in the skill positions. I mean, I've, I've seen everyone work hard. I mean, all the way down to the JV team. I mean, everybody gives it their all. Um, I remember just coming out and seeing the guys and in the locker room. They, everyone was dripping, pouring with sweat. And uh, that's when you're putting in some good work, man. We call it the dungeon. And when we're in the dungeon, it ain't nothing but work being done in there, baby. What, when you look at, that, at the schedule, what, what, what can you say about some of the games that, of the teams that you'll have to face? Well, I mean, to me, um, it's a pretty tough schedule. It's pretty solid. And like Coach says, man, when you're when you're trying to build a winning program, you have to play people. You have to beat people. If you want to be that guy, you got to beat the guy. And, um, you know, some familiar faces with the Glasgow's and LaRue counties. Um, opening week, Spencer County over in the bowl game, man, is going to be a very competitive. Uh, we're very familiar with Mikey. Uh, I've known Mikey for some years now, and so I know he always prepares his team. And as a first game, I think the first game is a good game, and it'll be a good measuring stick for our program here at Hart County. So, so at the end of the season, what, what, what are some of the things that you hope to accomplish for this well, team? Other than, you know, winning every game and, and, and taking home titles, what are some of the things that you that you hope to see out of your squad? Well, well, as any coach does each year, man, the process of being a coach is seeing the maturity and seeing the growth of your players. So uh, at the end of the year, I would like to see some players grow up. Some players have huge amounts of growth on the field and, and, and as well as off the field. Um, I want to I want to form some great relationships here at Hart County. And by the end of the year, I hope these young men can do something special for themselves um, and accomplish some things that no one could ever take away from them. So I just want to see these guys go out, the seniors go out on a high note, and, and, and for this team to have a good ride this year.